visitors from outer space or a natural phenomena. Surfers and early morning walkers were stunned to find thousands of alien eggs on a Sydney beach this weekend. Locals in D.Y., on the city's north shore, reported seeing a large number of the strange objects which had washed ashore overnight. But rather than the green spheres being something from another planet, scientists explained they were a type of sponge-like seaweed that forms egg shapes possibly to protect themselves from predators. Beachgoers said they'd never seen anything like it describing the balls as alien eggs, alien hairballs, Japanese moss balls and UFOs, unidentified floating objects. About three days ago, there were a few egg-shaped balls but then today, they were much bigger and everywhere on the beach, Naraina resident Jenny Jong told the Manly Daily. Scarlett de Villers from nearby Davidson saw the weird balls on her regular morning beach walk. It was a windy day with a very high tide. I picked one up and squeezed it and it was so squishy, but I wasn't sure if it was alive and was worried I might hurt anything inside, she told the Daily Mail. It struck me how perfectly shaped they all were and how green and alive they looked. Associate Professor Alastair Poor from the School of Biological, Earth and Environmental Sciences at the University of NSW said the balls were probably a rare type of living green algae, which has only been seen a handful of times around the world. I've seen similar things, sometimes dead sea grass can roll around and form balls like underwater tumbleweeds but that's made of dead material and these look to be living, he told the Manly Daily. It is a habit known as Egagropolius, where the algae is free living and forms into spherical balls. The Royal Botanic Gardens and Domain Trust's Alan Miller said the algae balls made their way to the beach with the right biophysical conditions, but that these conditions don't align every spring. It's clearly another response to spring sunshine, and just the right wave conditions to tumble them, said Mr. Miller. It's the second unusual natural spectacle to hit Sydney's beaches in a matter of weeks. Last month, the waves at Manly Beach were lit up a fluorescent blue for three nights by agitated phytoplankton, apparently signaling the start of spring.